this fittings which over time they start leaking and if you want to replace them they will not properly work, they will not seal properly. So what I use, I went to the hydraulic shop today and get this push-in connectors. This is for the 6mm line for the compressor, this one. And for the rest, this. Sorry, I have to do one-handed operation. And this is the fitting side. And this is the tapered uh, hole. As you can see, already fitted one. This will seal perfectly. It will avoid any leaks. And this will stay here for a long time. Total cost was around what you see here, less the elbows, around 10 or 15 dollars, or rings included. Sorry for the misfocus. And these are the originals, which I keep just in case. And as you can see, this is the final result. I didn't make a video before I put everything up, but now, no more leaks. Total cost, around 30 reals means $9. This, the, the metallic ones are rated to 60 PSI pressure. The push-in type, one for the um, uh, compressor line, is rated to 50 PSI. 50 or 60 psi. I did the run. I inflate all the, the the bags for the suspension, and there is no leak, no pop out, nothing. Everything works as intended. <laughs> and this is my assistant mechanic. Hope this helps. Pum, pum. Here. This one, the thread, it's 10 mm. For the rest, 10 mm thread with the 6 mm line. And this one will be 8 mm thread for uh, uh, 4 mm line. And let me see the rest. Focus, focus. This is what you call the collet. The one that will be sealed to the line. The insert has a tapered uh, hole. You just place this on top of the line then you're gonna fit this one with a slightly larger bevel upwards and this the other end will go into the insert once you tighten down this will take the shape of the tapered thingy in the insert and will seal perfectly no more leaks no more cracks and as per uh, and as I use previous originals from Mer from Mercedes from uh, Mercedes Benz, I was used to have issues with this one. I just push the line in. I do a test run, and some of them. This is from the compressor line. Some of them will crack here. Exactly what is my nail. Sorry for my nails are dirty, but working on a 10 years old Mercedes does that to your hands. And as you can see, this one is almost cracked. So from the beginning, from the get go, this is not a good option. Or maybe it's just a bad batch. Maybe I have bad luck. I don't know. As I said, 
everything works as intended.